Okay, I'm gonna be making Rice crispy Treats and I'm gonna use it to make a 3D Elmo cake topper. Um, this is my first time making them, so I just got the recipe off the web. So the recipe calls for three tablespoons of butter, um, a whole bag of the marshmallows, which is 10 ounces, and it's going to need six cups of Rice Krispies. So the first step is to just put the butter in a pot and put it on the stove and melt it down on medium, to, well low to medium heat. And I'll show you what that looks so like. So I put the butter on the stove. I have it on a medium setting. And we're just going to wait for it to melt. Okay, so our butter is now melted and I'm just going to add the um, marshmallow. I turned down the heat just a little bit so that um, the butter wouldn't start to brown. Sorry about the shakiness. Alright, I dumped the whole bag of marshmallows in here and I'm just going to mix. And we're just going to keep mixing and stirring until everything is all melted down. So this is what it looks like. It's about halfway done. I've been stirring it about every 10 seconds. Just I don't want it to stick. And I'll show you when it's ready to put the Rice Krispies in. Alright, that's almost completely done. I took it off the stove and I'm just going to keep stirring for another 30 seconds or so. And then I'm going to put in the Rice Krispies. Okay, I've already measured my 6 cups of Rice Krispies and that's what that looks like. And we're just going to pour it in now and alright I ended up needing a bigger pot the one I had just wasn't big enough to hold all the Rice Krispies in there that's the old one that's what I put them into now and they pretty much all look co as combined as they're gonna get and since I'm gonna be doing the Elmo Elmo head out of these Rice Krispies um, I set up a piece of wax paper on my counter and I'm just gonna start working on the shapes that I need and I will show you what they look like once I'm done. Okay, well here's the finished shapes that I'm going to be using. Of course they don't look like Elmo yet, they're not red. But um, I hope that once they're done, they actually look a little bit like Elmo. That's the head. And it kind of looks weird from here, but um, what's supposed to be Elmo's head? I got a one hand and arm right there. I have a foot right there. Another arm and another foot. So I hope I can show you guys when I'm all done with it. I will try and also show you what the finished cake looks like. I'm going to be making a cake for my two year old son. He's turning two next week. So. This is going to be his Elmo cake. Thank you guys for watching and I'll let you know how it turns out and I'll post either a video or some pictures on the rest of Elmo, the rest of making it. So keep, you know, stay tuned. Thank you.